Chris with Detailing Beast Magical Potions. And today I want to show you guys something that we concocted, 100% acid, real acid. So when you got brake dust that's caked on, baked on, and your regular degreaser can't get it off, 100% acid, baby. We're going to show you a quick sample of exactly what this acid can do on your wrist. As you can see, our acid Bruce Lee those rims. The best part about the acid is that it's 100% non-flammable, which means you can detail the engine if you want to, just knock it on out. As you can see, nothing can stop our acid. Order online today. Either the link is gonna be above or below. This is Prince, detailing beast. What does Bruce Lee, Michael Jordan, and Mike Tyson all have in common? They all had a mentor, and you need a mentor. Our mentorship classes will push you out of your comfort zone. We will give you strategies, concepts, motivation to not only be successful, but incredible in all your endeavors of life. We will encourage you and lift your auto detailing business to an all new level. All the greats had a coach. If you want to be great, sign up today and click that link below. Hey, welcome back. This is Prince Detailing Beast, Beast Mode Detailing, Grind Time TV, where we talk about different strategies on how to get you more money in your mobile auto detailing business. So um, <clears throat> today, what we talking about, before I even go into what we're talking about, man, um, got a lot of things happening, right? Just drop the new product line, so you'll, you'll start seeing um, commercials with our new product line, and um, anybody who wants to get into the chemical game, I want you guys to go ahead and text me, right? Text this number below, and um, I can fill you in on some information on how to get your chemical line started, all right? And what we call <clears throat> what we call drop shipping, baby. So if you definitely want to get into your chemical line, and you just want to hit me up, just go ahead and hit me up. I'll talk to you personally. We'll go from there. Uh, yeah, so we got the chemicals going. We got uh, Team Beast Mode. Definitely, if you guys want to join Team Beast Mode and get some of this work, definitely hit me up. All right, hit me up. Uh, the link is below. We'll go from there. Let's see what else we got. Yo, check this out. I've been developing this video game. I'm not done with it yet, but it's going to be on the um, on the Google on the Google Play Store. Right? It's the first. I think it's the first. I haven't heard of any other game like this. The first mobile detailing video game. Right. And so I got it set up like this. You uh, you and your mobile detailing van, your mobile detailing car, truck, whatever, right? Hopefully I can set it up where you can get the van, truck, blah, 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 and, and you build yourself up. But right now we're going to try and keep it simple. And uh, it's going to be for free, right? Free downloads and all that stuff. And those who are, um, I, I, I'll break down to you why I'm making a video game later on. But you know if I'm making a video game, um, it has to be some kind of uh, a reason why to make it? I'm not making it just just for fun. We're making it to make more money, right? So, <clears throat> auto detailing, um, mobile detailing, video game, right? So you're in your mobile detailing car, right? And your job is to see when you see dirty cars, you hit them with your car. That means you detailed it, right? And then you get money for it, right? But then there's other 
mobile detailers around you, right? And if they happen to hit your car, then they take your details, right? So it's, it's that kind of concept. However, it's very, very fun. And I want you guys to check it out. It's extremely fun. I'm not, I'm not done developing it yet, but so far I've been playing it and it's, it's very fun, very fun. My kid's like, ah, this is boring. But I know as a detailer, you're gonna love this joint. So if you're just sitting in between appointments, let me go ahead and get this detail game on, baby. Get this detailing game on. Anyway, man, um, <clears throat> listen, we got the clothing line, got the clothing line coming up, man. It's so many different things, so many different areas where you can make money in an auto detailing business, man, but you got to be able to have a coach, man. You got to be able to have someone to help you see what's actually out there for you, right? So we got the mentoring classes right now going at, what are we doing for like 20 bucks a month, bro? 20 bucks a month and you set yourself up with a session with me, all right? And go from there, bro, and take your business to another level, right? Change your entire paradigm, right, to where you're, where you're just, you, you, you're just, you're soaked in details is the word. You're soaked in details, man. And so that's what you want to do. You want to be, you want to be that expert. You want to be that guy that people go to when they say who's the expert in detailing. You want to be that guy, man. You want to be that guy, man. So we got so many different things. Again, um, for uh, a limited time, for a limited time, we got the app and the website going for twenty bucks a month too. If you just want the app. You can get the app at ten dollars per month, right? Just go to the go to the link below, click that mug, pay the ten dollars, boom, there's your app, right? Just like that. And all you gotta do is pay ten dollars a month, and you're straight. That's, that's it. That's it, right? So you can be the next Uber of auto detailing in your industry. And I tell you how to how to get people to download your app for free. There's a video out that I did. I can't. I think it's called how to sell your app or how to get people to down. I don't know what it is. It's app something, right? Go to that video. Check it out, man. It'll tell you everything about it. And the normal price for that app is like, I think we charge like one, no, we charge $500 for the app. We charge $500 for that app. So we, right now we're just charging 10 bucks a month and it's your app, all right? Your thing. Go do what you, do whatever you got to do with it, all right? And go ahead and start making this bread for yourself and your family. All right, so now, let's go into today's message. All right, so, I got a friend, I got a friend, partner of mine, my partner out in Texas, uh, just opened up his new auto detailing shop. It's called Evolutions with a Z, Evolutions with a Z, man. And uh, anybody who's in Houston, Texas, um, I know my man is probably looking for like help. He probably needs some mobile detailers because only going to be bringing in cake. All right. So you definitely want to hit my man up, right? Look for Evolutions. Evolutions, man. If I can remember, I put a link below to his website, and you go to his website and go from there. All right, <clears throat> that's for you guys in, in Texas. I don't know if he's in Houston or not. I know he's in Texas. I can't remember what part of Texas. Uh, but you'll see it on the website. If I put the link below, you'll see it on the website, man. So, um, and and I wanted to do this. This this is like when I had my shop. When I had my shop, I don't use the shop anymore. But when I had my shop. My shop was probably in the worst locations, right? The worst. And I was able to push work through that mug, bro. I was able to pump so much work through there. They thought for sure, homie is selling drugs or something over there. There's no way you got that many dirty cars out here, baby. Like, we got this mug running like a franchise, bro. Franchise, because we didn't care. I just need to keep work coming in nonstop, right? And <clears throat> it was one time we, um, we even opened it up for 24 hours. Right, open it up for 24 hours just to see if anybody come at one o'clock in the morning and want to get their car detail. And there was one or two people that actually did it, man. But as far as mobile detailing, mobile detailing, we keep it open 24 hours, man. You call me at like three o'clock in the morning, I'm gonna answer the phone, especially if you're a customer, answer the phone. But we're gonna charge you a little bit more to come to your crib and do that. Just, a, just an idea, right? Because all you gotta do is answer the phone, right? And if they and if you're able to get $500 or $600 for that detail at three o'clock in the morning. I think you should go get it. I know I would. I know I would. So anyway, I'm going to break down how to control your area. If you got like a, if you got a shop, even if you're working from the crib, right? This is some strategies that you can do to 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 bring up the money in your in your area to bring in more clientele in your to your mobile detailing shop. Even if you're working from a garage, bro, from your garage, right? 
and it's awesome. And I got some other tactics that I'm gonna break down to you also. So anyway, let's get right into it. Telling Beast Magical Potions. And today I want to show you guys something that we concocted 100% acid, real acid. So when you got break dust that's caked on, baked on, and your regular degreaser can't get it off, 100% acid, baby. We're going to show you a quick sample of exactly what this acid can do on your wrist. As you can see, our acid Bruce Lee those rims. The best part about the acid is that it's 100% non-flammable, which means you can detail the engine if you want to, just knock it on out. As you can see, nothing can stop our acid. Order online today. Either the link is gonna be above or below. This is Prince Detailing Beast. For a customer to get in contact with you, he has to search on Google, then find a number to call you. While searching, he sees all your competition ads. The auto detailing industry is growing in competition and in customers. Why not cut the middleman out and become the first Uber of auto detailing in your city with your own custom made detailing app with one click to call, online booking and push notification, you will be a force to be reckoned with. All the big company have an app. Once the client downloaded, it is on their phone forever. They never need to call another detailer again. Think about with only a thousand downloads, now you can send your notification out to a thousand people instantly. Click the link below to get started. Number one, you gotta know your radius, right? When, when we first got started, I was trying to hit everybody in my city, right? People that's like 30 miles away, I'm still trying to advertise to them, right? I found out that that's not gonna work, right? Because I don't care how good you are at detailing, right? If I just want my car clean, I'm not going 30 miles for you to clean it. I'm not gonna do it. Now, if you're a dope detailer, right? And I need my car detailed, 30 miles is no big deal. I had people actually ship their car to me from across seas to, for us to detail it, right? So that's very possible. However, if you're dealing with a local shop, you want to at least, you want to do at the very minimum, or let's say at the very max, 15 to 20 miles from your shop in your local radius. 15, that's how far you want to advertise. And once you advertise from that area, that way you get everybody in that community because your money is coming from your community, right? That community where that shop is at, that's where your money is coming from, man. So you want to be able to suck up as much money from that community as possible, right? Get as much money as you can from that community as possible. And so I got 12 ways to break this down on how we advertise and how we got so much work coming in at one time. Now, any one of these strategies will work by itself, right? It's cool. It'll work by itself and it'll bring in a little bit of income, right? But if you apply all 12 strategies and go completely, ah, beast mode on this mug, you couldn't stop the work coming in. Even if you tried, you couldn't stop it. You couldn't stop it, right? So anyway, number one, 12 ways how to advertise your new store, your new, your new detail shop, all right? Number one, you wanna go with radio, all right? If you haven't seen the video I did on radios, um, you wanna check that out, right? Should I, should I do radio ads? 
in there, I break down the different prices and, and stuff like that. How to use traditional um, advertising, um, radio advertising versus um, internet um, radio advertising, or satellite radio advertising. Two totally different worlds, man. But with internet advertising, you can actually, you can focus in on just my city, my 15, 20 mile radius with internet, internet satellite radio. And then it doesn't even cost that much, anywhere from 7 to $12 per 1,000 people that hear it. So if you're only doing it on Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, right? Let's say you invest $60, right? Let's say you invest $60 into this joint. Then 3,000 people are going to hear your ad, bro, in your neighborhood, right around the corner, right? That's how you kill it, bro. That's one strategy, right? If you go with traditional radio, if you go with traditional radio, that joint is going out everywhere, right? We don't know. It could be 30 miles away. It could be 50 miles away. You don't know, right? The thing is, when you when you got when you got satellite Pandora to be exact, when you got Pandora um, advertisement, this joint kills, bro. It kills. It kills. All right. So another one is direct mail. Now, what you can do with direct mail is you can go to Vistaprint, right? Go to Vistaprint, make you a postcard, right? Put you a nice little special, grand opening, nice little special, blah, 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 whatever you want to do on there. And then you can actually buy the zip codes from Vistaprint or rather, yeah, you buy the zip codes from, from Vistaprint to send it out to those different people. So you don't even see, you don't even see it. You pay for it. You create the you create the postcard, you pay for it, and then all of a sudden people start walking to your to your shop with, with a postcard. Hey, I want this special, right? Within a 15 to 20 mile radius, right? So it's not gonna be a whole lot of postcards, bro. Right? At the very max, let's say, let's say five thousand postcards to be safe, right? And so you make that investment, let's say it costs you five hundred dollars for five thousand postcards, right? But if you're doing a hundred dollar detail, you don't need but five cards to, to, to make that happen, baby. And so your your joint is going out. Let's say you got a you got a ninety day um, expiration date on that joint, right? So ninety days, ninety days, the mugs is coming in back to back. And what we did is like even if the customer said if customer called me like, listen, I, I got this coupon, but it said it expired like last week. I don't care. Come bring me your money anyway. I don't care. Right, the expiration date is on there, so they'll go ahead and hurry up and spend that money. So if you put a two-week expiration date, that's not enough time for them to decide. Right? It's enough time for some people, but most people, it's not enough time. Right? So you want to you want to pull that mug out 30 days. Right? 30 days is good. 30 days, come get it done. Right? And when those people come in, you get all that information from them, bro. Get all that information from them. And offer them all kinds of add-ons and different things that you got going on in your shop. That way you can keep this money coming in every day, all day. All right, so next is you want to set up a living social campaign. But I think that living social and Groupon, they merge together. So you set up one thing with living social and still with Groupon. So it doesn't even matter. It's the same identical company anyway, right? You set that up. Now, here's something that we did. Now, you don't have to do this, right? Because we didn't do this to make money. We did this to get popular, right? All right, so I made enough money on one car to let's say let's say we're doing we're doing exterior washing, right? Exterior washing only. Let's say exterior washing. Yeah, exterior washing only is what we're doing. Exterior washing. So we wash the outside. We um we wash the outside. Uh, no tire shine. We clean the windows. We dry it off. That's it. Go right. Um, we was charging. We charge Groupon. We charge Groupon 15 bucks for that, right? They bring it to the shop 15 bucks, right? But they got it on, on a 50% discount, so the only thing they had to pay was $7.50. Now, out of that $7.50, we only made $3.25, right, per car, right? But <laughs> I know you're like, man, that ain't no money, man. Yeah, 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 it's not. It's not no money, man, except when you're doing 500 cars in a month, right? So you take that 500 times that $3.25, and then you see what you come up with. Right, it was enough money for me to um, take care of my guys who, who was working there, and to take care of um, take care of uh, the the expenses, the soap. All we had was soap uh, at the shop. The water was paid for, so we didn't have to pay for water, which was you know great for us, you know. But we had enough clients coming in, and then let's say out of all the clients that's coming in, say you got a line of people coming in. Out of those line of people that's coming in, um, let's say one out of four. We, we were able to upsell them to a wax. 
we was able to upset them to a vacuum. We was able like the vacuum go like the vacuum goes. That joint almost it sells every single time. Just depends on how much you're doing. Cause you can go out there, you can say, okay, well, man, um, for an extra for an extra five dollars, we'll go ahead and vacuum out you know the cab of your 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 um your car, right? And they go for it. Every five dollars. That's it. Yeah. So all I spent was eight dollars and fifty cent, right? And that usually happened on every five clients. You might get one of them one of them to say no, right? So now technically now we're making now we're making five we're making um three fifty plus the five dollars eight dollars and fifty cent per five hundred vehicles. All right. Now you got you got um you got um. Wax, you got headlight restaurants, you got whatever you see that come down that line, you start selling, right? You gotta have somebody, you gotta have somebody in your team that know how to sell, that know how to hustle, right? That they, they got that talk game, right? So what we did, we had it set up. So we got we got one guy. So when they come through our, our shop, they come in one end and out the other, right? So it depends on how your shop is made up, but you can either do a, a loop, right? Where they come in one side loop and, and come right back out. So we have one side coming in, one side going out. And so um, we got one guy pressure washing the car when it comes in, okay? We got one guy um, scrubbing the car. So my guy with a pressure washer, he switched from he switched from rinse to soap, right? Then back to rinse. And my other guy, he scrubbed every car to come down. He scrubbed it. Then I got I got two more guys that's cleaning the out that's um drying the car, right? So I got one guy with a with a blower, right? He's blowing the the, the um the water off of the car, the other guy, he's drying, all right? So while he's drying, his, his rag, he keeps another rag on him so he keeps the windows, so he can do the windows with no problem, right? And if he have to spray it real quick, it's cool. The um the window cleaner's right here. So he can just spray it real quick, boom. And basically, we're getting those cars out at three, four minutes flat, right? Three, four minutes flat. Like, bro, we, let me tell you how we learned this. When I first got started, it was so crazy. First got started, I'm doing posts on Craigslist. That's why Craigslist is so important. You got to post on Craigslist. And if you haven't got the video on how to post, how to post on Craigslist, not how to post on Craigslist, but how to dominate Craigslist, you got to get it, bro. You got to get that video. I'm telling you. So I'm on Craigslist. Um, this is when I first got started. I'm on Craigslist. A guy hit me up on Craigslist. Said, hey, can you come down to Wilmington to the race racetrack? And detail some cars. I, I mean, I'm like, absolutely, I'll be more than happy to. So when we got down there, we found out that it was Richard Petty um, race team, right? I wish I would have took pictures back then. I don't have any pictures for you. I'm sorry. So you can believe me or don't believe me. I don't care. But the point is, every time, not every time, but when the when the when the race when the race car finished for the race, then we would wipe it off so we can get ready for the next race. And basically, what we do we just spray it down, wipe it off quick. Super quick, right? Boom, and that's it. We got paid for each time. Each time we did that, right? And we ended up leaving about seven, eight hundred dollars. It was pretty good for one day. Seven, eight hundred dollars. It was a nice little trip down there, but seven, eight hundred dollars, right? We good. So anyway, um, after that, anyway, that's how that's how we learned the joint, right? Doing the Richard Petty joint, right? So we got these joints coming in and out so quick, so quick, so quick. Now every now and then you will hit a lump, right? Every now and then you will hit somebody that come in. And, monster truck with all this daggone mud on top of like he waited to the last minute and that guy we charge extra yeah your car 20 bucks and really what we want him to do we want him to get out the line we want him to say ah you said it was going to be this price but it's now it's really that price we want you to get out the line we want you to get a refund because we ain't cleaning it right because you're going to slow down the traffic of money that's coming in now imagine this good brother imagine this now from from seven o'clock in the morning let's say from eight o'clock in the morning to eight o'clock at night you got an endless flow of cars. Endless. Coming in. Going back out the other side, man. You don't even remember half of the car. And you got your homie, which at the time it was just me. I'm the guy out there like, I'm, not, I'm the guy out there with this. Hey, would you like to get the wax done? Would you like to get this done? Let me get your coupon. You owe some more money. Da, 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 da. I want to get the vacuum. That's me, right? Right, and if the customer wanted to get vacuum, I got my homie Day Day sitting right over there. He can vacuum the joint, right? No problem, right? And he like, there's a lot of detailers out there that say they're good at at interior detail, but I had this one kid, man. This one kid, Day Day, Day Day, like <laughs> Day Day is a monk. Not just like he's good at interior details, but the dude do it so fast. And I'm like, I'm looking for mistakes. In the beginning, when I first hired him. 
I was finding little mistakes. But after working with me for about 30 days, 60 days, untouchable. Untouchable. Right? The dude was just, just good on interior, period. Right? He told me that he used to work for this um, franchise that's out here, and uh, that's all he used to do was interior, right? So I chopped him up, you know, tightened him up a little bit, and he was good to go. Good to go. Awesome dude, man. All right, so, so that's Living Social. Set up a small deal with Living Social where you can get an endless flow of money, right? So you want your money coming in every, not every hour, banking on every 15 minutes. Every 15 minutes, money need to be flowing. If you can get that joint down to like every five minutes, you're a monster. Every five minutes, you're making money. Every five minutes, because you just multiply 850 times one hour, times 60, and you will see what you're making an hour. Right? Just detailing cars, baby. Just cleaning cars, bro. That's all we do. That's all we do. So anyway, um, hook that up with Living Social. All right, so the next thing is you want your B2B rat cars. B2B stands for business to business. So <clears throat> here's something that we did. There are other businesses around us, all right? Um, and so what we do, we'll take our rat cars and put them in. Rat cars are no more than, than a postcard. They just shape different. And we'll put them in those different businesses. So when people go in there and buy something from them, they'll see our business, our business called Rack Cards. They'll pick it up from there and then they'll come in and, and uh, get their cards clean. Put a special up there or something like that, a coupon, right? Um, that didn't work too well at my first shop. It worked very well at my second shop because in my second shop, my second shop was on Broad Street, right? This joint is like almost like Main Street, right? So we got mad traffic coming through, right? The beautiful part about it is if I'm standing in front of the shop, Right across the street from me was a lady who, who delivered flowers. Right next to her was a coffee shop. Right next to that person was um, a pool hall. Right next to that person was a nail salon, hair salon. Right next to me was a, was a to the left of me was a funeral home. To the right of me was, <laughs> was a, um, a dentist's office. And then there was some more stores going on down there. Anyway, this, I took total advantage of this, right? So you want to use your environment your environment to your advantage. So on my website at the time, when people would book online, the in, I went across the street to the coffee spot, right? I asked the owner, hey, listen, is it okay if my customers come over here, come over here and wait and um, buy coffee from you while they're waiting to get their car clean? He said, yeah, no problem. Why, why wouldn't I do that? I said, cool, because I'm going to put it on my website. He said, yeah, knock yourself out. So what I did, I took pictures of his lobby. So his lobby is like decked out. His joint is flat. And I put it on my website like it's the inside of my lobby, right? And so when people get there, they're kind of looking. I, and I tell them, I say, listen, um, if you want to go, if you want to wait for your car, just go right across the street to the coffee shop, have a seat. They got free internet. Um, get some coffee on me. La la la. Look, that joint works, man. So if you got restaurants around your 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 um, detail shop, you got anything out there that you can use to your advantage, use it, bro. Use it. This video gonna be long. I already know. I ain't even got halfway through. Look, this video going to be long. Anyway, use it to your advantage, bro. Use it to your advantage. Now, my lady across the street um, with the flowers, she always, she she, she made sure her, her van stayed um, clean. I gave her a real sweet deal. Since she's right across the street, 10 bucks, right? 10 bucks. Bring it on across the street. We're going to clean it off for you. You keep going, right? And so, um, when it came to Valentine's special, we use that to our advantage. Right, I'm selling. Look, it come. Look, you get a bouquet of roses with your detail, right? When you detail it at the shop, right? And I charge the customer, even though I charge them, let's say I charge them a uh, hundred bucks, right? The bouquet of roses costs twenty dollars, right? Twenty bucks, right? So I still made eighty dollars off the thing. Plus, my dude got got the um, when he when he sends his wife up here. Wife get the detail, right? Because he bought the coupon. Get the detail plus the roses. It works out it, 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 brilliant. It was one of the best ideas I ever had, right? So this joint works good. Use your environment to your advantage, right? Use your environment to your advantage, good brother. Oh, 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 oh,